Hello, Berkshire Hathaway Home Services sales executives for our video message of the week. All right, this week we're in part two of our three-part series on the attributes of being a great realtor. And today's topic is knowledge. Now, before we just jump in, I have three points to share with you today, but I want you to understand that even though we're talking about knowledge today, it must tie into how we see the world because your knowledge and what you think about every day is always going to be affected by how you think. So today is no different. So let's jump into our first item and that is running your business like a business. Can you see how that ties right into how you think? So when we talk about knowledge, I want you to think about, you know, uh, understand that we're in a relationship business, but what my relationships depend upon is me running a successful and running a proper, efficient business. So I can service my clients very, very well. And without this thought process of thinking that I'm actually running a real business and not I'm not just a sales executive, and I mean that respectfully, but I'm really a sales executive that works for you, Inc. So you're working for a company within the organization, and it's your company. And you gotta really think of it like that, because when you do, you tend to see weaknesses and strengths in a different fashion, and it gives you the opportunity to push that knowledge, okay, forward in a very different direction when you really see yourself running a business. Secondly, okay, around this knowledge aspect, and that is how are your processes and your efficiencies? You know, um, a lot of times people will tell me, boy, you have a great memory. And the reality of that is, is, uh, you know what, I appreciate that, and I do believe I have a decent memory, but what really helps is having great systems, great processes, so you have a protection to have a great memory. Processes really help you be better. And so if you really do care about your clients, which I know you do, then the key with it is, is running your business like a business and driving that knowledge, you've got to step back and say, what are the processes and the systems and the efficiencies that I can put into place that protect my business so it can run as smooth and as effective as possible? And then third around knowledge is we all never stop learning and growing. You know, the worst scenario that you can get into is you get to a mindset, even though you've been in the business uh, potentially for years, that, you know what, I really know pretty much everything about this business. And you know, that's not true for any of us. I don't care what position you're in, leadership, okay, sales, whatever the case may be, is we're always gotta keep pushing ourselves forward, learning and growing. One thing we know that is an absolute and that's change. So as the business continues to evolve and change, you've got to push yourself to learn more. Sometimes those classes or those learnings whatever they may be, push us out of our comfort zone because they're not really comfortable dealing in all aspects. That's okay. It may not even be you doing every single task, which it should not be, but guess what? That doesn't mean your business doesn't need to know about it and doesn't need to be able to do it, even though it may not be you directly doing it. Knowledge is key in the aspect of being a great realtor. Okay, and running your business like a business, continuing to learn and laying those processes and those efficiencies and systems will always make you a better realtor. Have a great week, everybody, and we'll talk to you next week.